Hi folks, I've, uh, I've got some stuff done in the garden, not a lot, not as much as I'd like. I've got my alums in little comp uh, little modules to start them off as all my beds aren't ready. Uh, although I have got a new compost bin which I've put together at last. And um, I've got some potatoes, uh, the Ziri, these are the only ones I'm doing this year. I'm with the buckets though, but these are the only ones. Any thoughts on these? Anybody who's grown these before? I've never tried them before so anything on that will be handy. Um, post. Anyone who's been waiting for post, it's posted. I'm really sorry about that. Very late with everything. I've had some strange things going on this year. Oof, I get that. It's like somebody walking over your grave, innit? But anyway, I'll get on with it. I'll show you my uh, compost bin. It's not 100% fer finished, fertig. It's not 100% finished, but um, I've just got a few screws to put in tomorrow. Today I'm going out to lunch with a 81 year old lady. Don't ask. It's not for money, it's my mother in law. Nice to be nice. And I've also got these in elephant garlic, shallots. It's the first time I've found them. And uh, 40 normal garlic there. And they're the onions I started inside. So, wooden bed, not very good really. Don't last two minutes here. Crappy compost bins that explode. Can't control it. So, the idea is a compost, new compost, and uh, another new bed. I'm going to try and double size the compost. See how we go. So, this is the basic idea a centre panel in it using some of this T profile make a frame so I've got a centre panel and two bays hopefully I'll be able to swap it over whatever I've got one more sheet of this and uh, hopefully I'll be able to use that and slide it in as doors I'll just show you why I ended up with this material see them dents in there that's hail damage and this stuff was the size of golf balls. It's two or three years ago now. They even had to change air conditioning units. All well, air conditioning units were just battered. I've never seen out like it in my life. Entire side of a building. That's where I got all this material from. This were all going in to skip. Obviously, insurance has paid for it. But uh, nice, eh? That's what we call hail. hail. Don't look at that because I've just done shed, so a lot of bags of shite were in there. This is all stuff that I've, I've moved out, which is going somewhere else. <laughs> what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a row of these slabs down here. The reason I'm getting it separate from here is because before there were mice and all sorts, so dogs are always chasing around it. So if it's freestanding, it's away from it. What I'm going to do here is put a piece, put a flap on it, so that it can be loaded from top here. I'll have a path all the way around here way up there now and bring that bed forward as well because from my idea was water coming off of this roof and dropping into the bed as well which weren't very good that's what front will look like these will just come off easy pull them out I had to cut that I cut that last panel in half and uh, had to rebend it on one side and along bottom on that one because it fall on the floor Stupidly, I should have put that panel on back, but uh, I might just put a patch over that, it doesn't really matter. I'm very slow this year now, sun's come out and I'm behind. Now this is what I've done for the lid. I've got to screw this down. I couldn't find any proper washers for this, so I'm going to put some normal washers on and put a bit of silicon on. There's a few holes in it, because it's obviously recycled this. But, to load it and unload it just like that and I'm not doing an opening on that because what I'll do is I'll be able to turn this and then move it onto the other bay and hopefully finish it and make decent compost I'm still way behind look I've got one of the beds ready there's another bed round the other side which is ready but I'm going to make all new beds but I don't know what's happening with this here it's monstrosity these are sponges I'm going to do one as I can take and take a thumb off. Uh, if it's really full, 
it's uh, it'll spring out but I can tighten these up and my other thought is now that I might put some hinges on it I'll have to hinge this one that door from here and that door from here due to the fall up floor but it's not a huge job so I'm quite pleased because uh, it's got to be much better than that crap they're absolutely useless uh, thoughts I've had that is, I might put it all together as a square, put some caps on the end and see if I can make, because uh, I can I can make it secure, even I thought about putting a couple of ratchet straps around it and uh, screwing that through and turning it into a tumbling composter, I only have to put some ends on it, you know what I mean, but that's, an, that's for another story.